John, final group stage game of the Premier Sports Cup tomorrow against Dennis Muir, um, a local derby. Um, I think we spoke after the Bucky Thistle game about how good um, a game this would be to, to end the group stage, um, but looking like it's going to be quite tight come the end. It could well be. It's up to us to, uh, first and foremost, win the game. We've got to remember it is a derby game, and from that point of view, both teams will be up for it. I expect Stenny to be up for it as well. Probably been a while since the last time they played Falkirk, and uh, big crowd expected again. So that will add to the atmosphere, and the fans will meet the atmosphere, and of course that will get the two players, uh, two sets of players, up for it. Uh, so, yeah, we know that uh, we have to win the game. If we win the game, the worst case scenario is we will be second in the group, and then it will be all these sort of. Uh, you know, ifs, buts and maybes as to who scores a last minute goal that could change the whole thing. Uh, so, in an ideal world, if we can keep a step ahead of uh, Air United and the, the goal scoring uh, stakes, then that would be the ideal situation to win the league and go through as group winners. And that would save a little bit of anxiety. Uh, come 10 to 5 tomorrow night, 5 to 5, 5 o'clock, whenever the games finish. Uh, who knows? Yes. Yeah. Staying just along the road. Hopefully they'll bring you know a few few fans as well. Uh, they've had a good start when they beat Bucky. You know they've got a four goal uh, advantage over Bucky, which is as much as like ourselves did and, and better than than United did. So we uh, respect them. We were at the game on Tuesday night. They got a great start against the United. They went up in front early on. Lad Taylor took his goal really, really well. But to be fair, you know, I thought Ayr were very good on the night. Uh, and I think, you know, I think they, 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 they won the game deservedly 4 1. So, depends how Staney go about it on Saturday. We've got to take the, the game to them. The first goal is always important in these games. If we can try and get that an early goal and uh, build on that, then. It maybe uh, sets us up for, uh, you know, as you say, maybe a nail-biting finish come five-ish when the games are finishing off and, you know, a last-minute goal could uh, change the, the, uh, you know, the, the finishing places in the group. Obviously, yourself and the rest of the squad will be going into it confident, um, given the, the previous performances so far in the group stage. Um, and obviously, there was that one loss to, to Air United, but the performance was still really good, um, kind of keeping that going from the performances last season as well. Um, how important is that momentum and, and to keep that momentum going um, with the, the league starting less than a week after um, tomorrow? Yeah, I mean, I think we've been consistent for such a long time now. You know, all the, the whole of last season were very, very consistent. We've been consistent. Yeah, it didn't quite win, but we've been very, very consistent in our performances. Really good, really encouraging. Uh, I, I still feel we had more goals in us up at Bucky, and I think we left, you know, about five goals there. But, however, you know, uh, we still, still scored five. And the performance was very good. So, uh, yeah, our level of performance... It's been right up there all the time, and I'm sure if we can do that tomorrow, then I'm, I'm sure we'll uh, we'll win the game. It's just a matter of how many how many goals we can get, and then also trying to keep a little bit tabs on what's happening at air, you know. Um, some good news as well, maybe this week um, around the the squad. Um, are you able to give us an update on maybe players who are are coming back from injuries? Yeah. So Cole Donaldson is trained all week and he will be available for selection. Callum Morrison is the exact same. He's trained all week and is available for selection, as is Leon McCann. So delighted to get these three guys back in the fold. Unfortunately, Aidan Nesbitt has picked up a little bit of a hamstring injury. Nothing too serious, but he will miss this week. And of course, we don't want to take any chances with that. The league campaign starting next week. Um, Jamie Sneddon, unfortunately, has picked up a little bit of a hip any area injury again nothing too serious but we're just going to have to uh, be a little bit patient with that so we gain three lose a couple uh, but delighted with the three that we've got back absolutely delighted to get called back in uh, keelan has been playing a little bit out of position and done exceptionally well uh, it's good to get Callum back you know uh, Callum's as everyone knows been top goal scorer the last three seasons and Leon, uh, you know, uh, has had two great seasons in the, in the time that I've been here. So, good to get these guys back. 
maybe a, a bit of a relief for, for yourself and the rest of the coaching staff that they, they are being available. I think um, there was maybe a little bit of concern amongst the fan base that they maybe wouldn't be ready in time, so it must be really, really good. Yeah, we've got to be a little bit cautious at times because sometimes you can... Until the guys get back in and training and see the reaction, you know, you can be doing rehabilitation and rehabilitation and rehabilitation. But in these situations, the physio is telling you, turn there, turn here, stop there, go there, do this, do that. As soon as you go back into training, the ball moves, you're moving different directions, different paces, you know, you have to adapt very, very quickly. And all of a sudden, you've done something that you've not done in the rehabilit in, you know, in your rehab. And all of a sudden, you know, if it's a, a swollen knee, it swells up. If it's a sore groin, it gets sore. You know, so sometimes we're a little bit cautious. But we're delighted to say that... Uh, They've come through the training all week, flying colours, no issues whatsoever with these guys, and they are also looking very much forward to this game. Absolutely, very good news. John, thank you very much and all the best for tomorrow. Thank you.